Wayne's World part time, that's me. She might be a tourist, a terrorist. A hell's night dragon like she haven't seen law. All I think about is you. Hey y'all. Y'all, yesterday took me out emotionally. I was out. And unfortunately, I was like emotionally eating. So yeah. But anyway, today is a new day. We're resetting. I'm actually on the way to um some type of I gotta figure out what it is. I'm about to get in the car with my sister and figure it out. Okay, I'm in the car with Sissy now. We're on the way to the Thompson Hotel. I think it's like downtown Houston to this stretch percussion lab activity class thing so whoop, 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 whoop. we have on workout outfits um mine mine's nothing new and since got on all black because all black will always win period so my battery's actually about to die so i'm gonna charge my battery and i'll connect with y'all in a second okay y'all so we are here we're waiting on the class to start so if I did not tell you, it's a percussion stretch class lab. And it's supposed to start at two, but they said they're gonna start a little bit later, like 15 minutes after, which is fine because we got here like at two o'clock. Um, oh, and don't mind my pimple patch. I got one like right there. Anyway, um, this is at the Thompson Hotel in Houston. just found out that um <laughs> we just found out like the class that we turned up for it's basically like a workout class so let me show y'all what sissy got on and then she'll show y'all what i got on hey sissy got on a two-piece black set it's like and then without my jacket because i'm taking my jacket off i got on a two-piece set as well that i can work out in I don't know what to do. So this is funny because there's other people in here working out and this is a hotel so it's like established order. But Sissy hate working out and she don't know what to do. And I'm loving this because I'm like yes I can get the workout in the middle of the day so let's go. Okay so I'm about to go work out until I guess she's ready for the stretch percussion part. I think it's like a massage. Look, bitch, I'm a star, got these niggas wishing. He say he hungry, this nigga see the kitchen. Yeah, that's my doubt, he gon' sit down and miss it. Call him a trick and he don't get a holler. Bitch, I'm a star, got these niggas wishing. He say he hungry, this nigga see the kitchen. Yeah, that's my doubt, he gon' sit down and listen. Call him a trick and he don't get a penny. He know he giving his money to Megan. He know it's very expensive to date me. Call him, go put my name on that account because when I need money, I ain't tryna holler. He know he giving his money to Megan. He know it's very expensive to date me. Call him, go put my name on that account because when I need money, I ain't tryna wait. I can't be fucked with no. Oh, you can't touch this. Hey, bitch, I don't free shit. Uh, my money thick. Hey, walk with a limp, limp. Uh, I'm on some pimp shit. Hey, he say you all about money. Yeah, I'm on that cash shit. Uh, I'm in my bag, bitch. Uh, I'm on your ass, bitch. Uh, I'm in that new, new shit.
So today is Saturday. I'm actually, I've been a bad vlogger for today, this whole weekend actually. Um, I have not done anything or pick y'all up. Well, I've done some stuff. I've been editing or whatever and taking care of other things, but I just haven't been picking up the camera. But anyway, um, I hope I'm not screaming at y'all because I put some eardrops in this ear, in my left ear, and oh my gosh, y'all, I cannot hear. It's like quarter very, mile. very Turn right onto South Freeway. But anyway, I'm on my way to go meet my friends to start the birthday celebration. If you don't know a Leo or don't know me, we celebrate often and maybe like throughout the entire month. So we're starting with celebrating with friends. Turn so right onto South Freeway. that's where we're on the way to go. Lane to take the okay, y'all, I just got downtown. I parked. Oh my gosh, my ear is killing me. Like I cannot hear everything is so freaking muffled um my hair did not come out like i wanted to but we're here gonna make it work it is hot as shit. it's so humid here it's ridiculous but we're in our way well let me just pay for parking real quick so i have a car to come back to and then we'll go in the restaurant now now let's go G. Yes, I need this. It was cold in here. It's cute. Doc, he had work. I had choppers. I make fans with my partners to me. 
We are on a move. Now everybody's going to their car and we're going to the next spot. I'm not sure where we're going because no one would tell me anything. But we're here. Dinner was good. Bungalow was actually alive. The food was good too. Hey. We here downtown. All the girls are here. Ooh. Wait, here we go. Okay. We're all here. We're all here. Where are you? There you go. And Mo's ahead of us. They got me walking in here, y'all. And it's humid. It's 116 degrees outside. I'm over exaggerating. It's probably like 90, 89. But the humidity is hot and boiling. Okay, so now we're on to our second location. Girl, my jacket's in the car, and my car is like 85 blocks away. I know it. So everyone is starting off with the first one. So on your taste notes, you see uh, underneath taste notes. You'll Okay guys, we went out to eat at Bungalow and then we went to Pier Noir, which is a wine um, place here in Houston. If you travel in Houston, those are both places that you want to go to. I'll give you all the details later, but in the meantime, we're going to another spot. So now it's a turn up time. We all changed from our heels to tennis shoes. So let's get into it. Unfortunately, I am not bringing you guys on with me, but I'll be back to tell y'all everything about it. Okay, bye. <laughs> I'm finally back home. 
it's about mm, it's going on like three o'clock in the morning my ear literally just popped on the way coming home which is crazy because i couldn't hear all night but now i feel like i don't know congestion or something so maybe something's draining anyway my friends did a great job of celebrating my birthday starting the whole leo season birthdays and stuff like that they did a such a good job they did not tell me where we were going what we were doing at all they literally just said make sure that you're dressed and ready at such and such time and i gave them hell y'all <laughs> um unfortunately due to um past past trauma i guess you want to call it due to past trauma or whatever i did not fully trust them which i should have because these are like my closest friends like i've been rocking with them for over 10 years um and then obviously with my sister or whatever my sister was involved in it too we were able to celebrate her so that was good um so yeah like they did such a good job so um if i did not mention we went to bungalow first the food the service the ambiance the vibes the drinks everything again another spot if you come to houston and want a place to go to um if you want to go on a date if it's just girls nights all that bungalow downtown is good and i think they're black owned if i'm not mistaken um and then we went to what did we go after that um we walked to crew but that's a pass for me um, crew just for a younger crowd, a more tolerable crowd in terms of how they talk to you. And I'll just leave it at that. For me, in my big age, crew ain't for me. But I tried it, tried it twice, three times, and just it ain't for me. Um, what did we go after that? Oh, we went to a wine bar. We went to a wine bar before we tried to go to crew, but we went to this wine bar called um, Pure Noir, which is black owned as well. And that's downtown. So if you come to Houston, check out that place. And we did a tasting, which is really good. We had a tasting of six wines really, really well. And then we went to Third Ward of Houston, Texas. And we went to, well, we went to Savoy. And Savoy is like near and across the street from D Bar. And another, I please, I, if I'm not mistaken by memory, I think it's called Lexington. I think, but they have, I heard they got really, really good food too. And also um, the spot, the original spot. So, really good. My friends did a really good job of serving bougie and ghetto which I love, like, I like the five star, I like top tier, I like all of the fancy things, but I like to do hood rat ratchet shit with my friends, so, hmm, good, good combination. Anyway, like, they just did a really good job, so, if Mo, AK, Jazz, if y'all watch this, I want to say thank you again for making my birthday celebration amazing. So, so good. Like, y'all did so well. Thank you for your time, energy, money, and anything else that you spent to make sure that I was good. Like, just to make sure that you catered me. Um, Just really, really well, so... Um, I'm a lose. I, I should have more words to say or whatever. I'm usually the person that surprise other people. I'm the person that gives other people. So like for my friends to collectively come together and do that for me and, and to involve my sister or whatever, like top tier love emojis, all of that good stuff. So anyway, if y'all don't have friends who look out for y'all a one without any um 
prerequisite without any I don't even know what all the words I should be saying, but without any stipulations at all, man, try and give it for real, for real. I love my friends. But anyway, I'm gonna talk to y'all later. It is about, it's almost 3 a.m. in the morning. Obviously, I'm tired. I already started taking off my jewelry and stuff. So yeah, your girl is done. But if y'all didn't see my little outfit before I let y'all go, let me see. I changed and put on my little shoes or whatnot. <laughs> but this little two-piece outfit, this little two-piece outfit right here came from Sheen. Yes, baby. So, yeah. Okay, y'all. I am sleepy and tired. I'm so happy, though. I love my friends. Okay, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye. <clears throat> Wayne's World part-time, excellent. She might be a tourist, a terrorist. A hell's night dragon like she haven't seen law. We can go sightseeing and all that. She can be wifey and all that. She's the tourist, I'm a tour guy. Cause he just bullshit, I hit bullseye. But we got a light headed red eyes. I told her, don't worry, we stay high. Plus, there's a bed on my tour bus. So you can get fucked as we pull up. I pull up like skirt in the wall. I pull up a skirt and get gnarly. She come to Wayne World just to party. And all of my tourists are responding. Okay.